Good morning, everyone. On this Wednesday in the 20th week in Ordinary Time, we're continuing our, our journey through the book of Ezekiel. We're in chapter 34, verses 1 through 11. The word of the Lord came to me, Son of man, prophesy against the shepherds of Israel, and these words prophesy to them. Thus says the Lord God, Woe to the shepherds of Israel who have been pasturing themselves. Should not shepherds rather pasture the sheep? You have fed off their milk, worn their wool, and slaughtered the fatlings, but the sheep you have not pastured. You did not strengthen the weak, nor heal the sick, nor bind up the injured. You did not bring back the stray or seek the lost, but you lorded it over them harshly and brutally. So they have scattered for lack of a shepherd and become food for all the wild beasts. My sheep were scattered and wandered over all the mountains and high hills. My sheep were scattered over the whole earth with no one to look after them or to search for them. Therefore, shepherds, hear the word of the Lord. As I live, says the Lord God, because my sheep have been given over to pillage, because my sheep have become food for every wild beast for lack of a shepherd, because my shepherds did not look after my sheep, but pasture themselves and did not pasture my sheep. Because of this, shepherds, hear the word of the Lord. Thus says the Lord God, I swear I am come against these shepherds. I will claim my sheep from them and put a stop to their shepherding my sheep so that they may no longer pasture themselves. I will save my sheep that they may no longer be food for their mouths. For thus says the Lord God, I myself will look after and tend my sheep. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Well, Ezekiel, as we remember, he is in Babylon. Yet most of his prophetic work is to share with the folks back home in Jerusalem. And the shepherds, whether it's the political or the spiritual, those that are supposed to be shepherding, as he puts it here, are more concerned about their own self-comfort rather than doing what is necessary for the folks that they are supposed to be shepherding. And so judgment will come upon them. There will come a day of judgment. But one of the most important lines out of this whole uh, prophetic word is that last line. Did you catch it? It's pretty profound. This is what it says. This is what the Lord God says. I myself will look after and tend my sheep. I myself. That emphasis in the English is that same emphasis that's found in the Hebrew. It's an emphatic I. I'm going to do this. I don't know about you. When I hear those words, I cannot think, cannot help but think that it is our own Lord Jesus Christ the great shepherd who shepherds over us all. Stay safe, folks. Hopefully we'll see each other soon. Bye for now.